Good morning everyone, um, hi I'm Steve, um, today I'm going to give you a quick tutorial on drawing a very very simple snail using um, the letter E as a starting point. Just using my uh, trusty Norris HB pe pencil here, you can kind of get from, I think I actually got this from a school, so most kids normally have these. So this is a great little exercise to show um, your children and work with them with, so um, okay. So we're going to start with drawing ourselves just the basic E shape on our paper, like that. And then what that should do is that should allow us to extend this central section here to create the central spiral. If you, I'm almost drawing like another E shape to connect it. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go all the way around from the bottom here. I'm going to draw all the way around, so they almost end up with like a nice big spiral shape. And I'm just going to connect those up at the bottom, like that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this intersection here, and I'm going to draw the starting of our head shape. And I'm going to bring it all the way around, underneath, nice flat bottom. And then I'm going to extend that and join it together. And then I'm just going to bring the tail up to meet the top part of the body. So you can see that the shell sits on the snail's body. And then all we're going to do is we're going to add our little eyes at the top here. Nice little smile. Maybe some little freckles there. <laughs> and then I'm just going to extend the floor down here. And then what we're going to do, this is, uh, you don't have to do this, but this is a good way of just getting a bit of depth to the shell, is just to add some little rounded lines that follow the sort of contour of the shell. And there we go. Like I say, they're not necessarily needed, they just give a little bit of extra depth without actually having to shade anything. And then we have it. There's our um, basic sh um, snail from the letter E. And there's my version I did earlier, which I forgot to record. And then uh, here's a couple of other examples. Just using a little bit of shading or a little bit of pencil work. There's some other examples here. A little bit more detailed, but kind of give you an idea of where you can start and how you can continue. There we go. Thank you very much for watching.